Hello everybody. This is uh, a presentation on uh, a medical claims analysis dashboard built by Ad the company in Egypt. Ad the company is a specialized BI company, especially in the insurance industry. Uh, it's been uh, working in this field for more than 20 years. And uh, uh, in few minutes, we will demonstrate here how to present uh, or uh, how uh, ADDA is building uh, the medical analysis dashboards to its clients. This is just a sample uh, to show you some of the capabilities of uh, the uh, medical claims analysis dashboards. Uh, let's quickly uh, understand uh, the different parts of the dashboard. We have here a column chart uh, for customers, another column chart for hospitals, a map uh, chart for a uh, tree map for medical centers, another bar chart for in-out medication and uh, uh, medical services, uh, also a date filter here. Uh, we, we have uh, something called what if analysis. So this will show us how if the claims are uh, more or less uh, uh, a certain percentage. This uh, I will explain uh, what is the benefit of this. And at the end of the dashboard, you will see three KPIs. Uh, one for out medications, uh, one for in medication, another one for final costs. And here we will be able to see the details of any uh, uh, analysis. So now let's start uh, by understand uh, how dynamic this dashboard uh, is. The dashboard is uh, built by Click. Click is the second largest dashboard systems in the world, and we are partner uh, with uh, Click. Uh, the dashboards uh, can carry on uh, analysis for millions of records uh, uh, in no time because the, all, the, all the data are loaded in the memory of the computer. So now we are uh, using one of the latest technology, uh, which is uh, called in-memory database. This will uh, allow us to, to load a lot of records, millions of records, in the computer memory, so there's no I.O. operation with the hard disk anymore. Now, we, if we want to uh, uh, drill down any details for any uh, business dimension, it's now a piece of cake. So here are the customers. We have some customers, they are sorted by their uh, claim amounts. And uh, the blue bar is in medication, medications uh, given inside the hospitals, and this is uh, by uh, reimbursement claims, the red line, uh, out medications. So this is a customer, a customer number 444 has this amount. We can, uh, if you click on the customer, all related uh, uh, dashboard uh, analytical parts, change it to show you the related uh, how the amount of this customer being distributed among the, uh, the other business parameters. So this is uh, just in no time as you see if you click on the other customer. Now the data here, the, this customer number 376 has uh, this amount in medication and that amount outpatient and he's been uh, served by those medical centers mainly the, uh, those four medical centers um, and we can we can see also in which hospital this customer number four if we increase a little bit so he's been served by those uh, I mean uh, this um, customer being uh, uh, served in uh, other governor rates uh, 15 and uh, um, and so on so if you click on the on this customer, say okay, the the customer is really a corporate company or a bank or whatever. So he has some members inside it. So you can see how many how how are the members are distributed uh, for this customer as you see, uh, uh, just like this. So now we are in the customer number four four four. These are all the members being given uh, medical claims or medical treatments in uh, hospitals. You can stop uh, by any uh, member to see uh, where that member is uh, served. 
So uh, this uh, member has zero out medication and this amount only uh, in governorate uh, nine. So this governor knight has some hospitals, four or five, so he's, he's been in the hospital number four and five. Uh, yep. Uh, actually, it's four, five, six, and, and these hospitals are shown here. So this is really a very dynamic dashboard. Uh, you can analyze to any details as per the design. You can go back to, to filter any data. Meanwhile, you can also uh, play the what if game. Now we are showing all figures loaded by 11%, and this actually helps for uh, uh, budgeting, for uh, analyzing the data. Uh, this uh, claims could be uh, uh, any other business parameters. We can increase or decrease. So you uh, you can play with this uh, sliding bar to see the impact if the claims are less or, uh, or increased or decreased. So this is really uh, something uh, good for uh, analyzing data, for expectations or budgeting, uh, and so on. We can also analyze by date. So if you click on 2014, you have uh, three quarters. This is all data for quarter number one for year two, uh, 2014, showing these amounts. Type. If you want to have detail, to see the details of, uh, of uh, those uh, uh, criteria, you just uh, enlarge the details and you will be able to see all the details. It is transactions by transaction. No matter how many, no matter how many records, it could be millions. And as you see, it came in no time. So this is really amazing. This is this wasn't there in the OLAP systems or any data mining or whatever because the previous technologies uh, wouldn't allow to have such uh, in-depth details because uh, we read we were reading the data from the hard disk. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this uh, video. Thank you very much, and uh, see you in another video. Bye bye.